it was such a creative challenge to promote a new meditation program. We just loved it and came up with the cube. Our idea was to create a story about a guy who lives inside the iconic Astro Place Cube in New York City. Uh, his name is Dave, he's a frustrated writer who uh, needed to disconnect and unplug and just didn't know how to deal with the distractions uh, of his life. And his solution was to move inside the Astro Place Cube. The way we pulled it off was we created a perfect replica of the actual cube inside an artist studio in Brooklyn. It took several months to build and make it look like a livable apartment. What was cool about the Cube project was that we could create our own environment. We outfitted it with every single detail, including a generator, a toilet, a bedroom, a bathroom, a kitchen, and we even built a custom ladder, which flips out. It was challenging to shoot inside the Cube replica. It's a tight space. Uh, it was three of us in there at all times. It was Dave, me, and our camera guy, and we were sweating. It was tricky to hide inside that space and not be in the shot. The way we created the illusion that Dave is actually climbing in and outside the cube was we recreated one of the six panels of the cube. We placed it on a truck. We positioned the truck a few feet next to the cube. And the reason we did that is because we wanted to see that panel and Dave going in and out and at the same time see the surrounding buildings of Astro Place. And that's what really made the whole thing believable, that we were really in that space. What's cool about the idea of a man in the cube is it's almost plausible. In fact, everywhere you're now seeing headlines of people living in tiny, tiny, tiniest spaces that this video really supports. The video ends with Dave saying that he's moving out because he discovered Will, this new kind of meditation. So that was our story arc, you know, to communicate that, you know what, there's something better out there. This thing called Will, it's the way to go. Mm -hmm.